Hey guys, what's going on? Jamie here. Just wanted to do a quick update to start off the week. Um, you can see here, Mint, Stake, Share doing really well. The token back up over that 14 cent mark. Uh, what an incredible weekend, right? I mean, just before the weekend started, this was at, um, what was it at? Eight cents or something like that. I don't even remember. It was such a crazy weekend. And then it just went ballistic, as you can see right here. It just went bananas, took a little bit of a dip. And now we're back over that 14 cent mark appre uh, approaching uh, the all-time high again. And we might even break and uh, hit a new all-time high. Who knows? We might hit 15 cents because, again, usually comes down during the weekend when people claim. And then throughout the course of the week, it starts to creep back up. So we'll see what happens here as we approach the next AMA this Thursday. Uh, but you can see here 6.77% over the last 24 hours, $1.2 million in liquidity and the market cap looking insane, four and a half million dollars. It was crazy how, you know, when this thing first started, people were making a big deal about hitting a million dollars market cap. And here we are at four and a half million, soon to be five million. And uh, this thing just keeps on cranking away. So, yeah, let's go ahead and do a quick update. Of course, not a financial advisor. Never take anything I say as financial advice. If you do decide to jump into min stake share, do your own research and due diligence. Understand that there is risk in everything you do in the crypto space. If you're going to get in, risk capital only, guys. Okay, only uh, put only put funds that you can afford to lose. And uh, yeah, make sure you follow me on Telegram, subscribe to the channel, all that good stuff. So. That being said, um, yeah, uh, 14 cents, man, crazy. Um, pretty wild, pretty wild. Just a couple of days ago, we were making videos saying, hey, will this hit 10 cents? Will this hit 10 cents? And here we are at 14 cents, literally like 72 hours later. <laughs> pretty crazy. Um, but yeah, this thing is looking good. Um, you know, big thing here I want to point out is uh, I think... Yeah, look at this. Mint is cheaper than swap right now. That's that's uh you know, now we'll see if it holds like that. But you know, previously people were swapping because it was cheaper to swap. And here we are. Uh minting right now is cheaper than swap. Not by a lot, but still, it's still cheaper right now to mint. And again, as people mint this thing, that helps the liquidity. You know, that I think we're gonna see the liquidity if people are minting, right? And it's the smart thing to do as long as it's cheaper than cheaper to swap we're going to see this thing the liquidity we're going to see it you know continue to go up and up and up uh, which is great right it's just great for the project it's great for optics i mean it's just great all around right um so all of this is happening before the launch of base which by the way you can see here um you can actually switch to the base uh you know you can switch to the base one already not live yet okay so can't do anything on it yet. Um, but you can see that the dev is dev in a way, doing his thing. Um, so pretty soon, we're going to have the launch of base. Then the lending protocol is going to launch. I think in between there, we're going to have the ability to airdrop our team members, which is fantastic. You know, I can't, you know, I can't wait to do that. That'll be great. Um, you can see here, our position right now is at 1.1 million uh, tokens staked. USD value is 155,000. We got another $3,000 in our balance worth of tokens. And this is just going to keep growing and growing faster and faster as this thing, you know, just starts to really take off. Um, so yeah, let me, uh, let me compound. We have $3,000 here in our available balance, uh, just under 22,000 tokens. Let's compound that into our balance and you know I had someone ask me um I think earlier today they said that can we unstake you know what we put in um no you can't unstake you know it's very similar to you know other dapps you know similar to drip right if you were in drip you can't unstake what you put in put in you can only you know withdraw out or claim or collect your dividends right um now of course as you guys know you know some people said is there a cap you know are you able to claim until you hit a certain percentage no you there's, there's no percentage per se uh but the way they have it 
structured so that people can't just withdraw, 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 and just drain out the contract, so to speak, is the amount that you claim, that amount of tokens gets deducted from your deposit balance, okay? So if you do decide to claim, 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 you'll eventually, you know, your deposit balance, you'll eventually dwindle down to zero at some point. So you'll claim yourself out of the project, right? Out of the, you'll, you'll position yourself that you're not going to be able to claim anymore and you're not going to have a, you know, a balance. So that's the way they've structured it, which I think is genius. I think it's a great way to do it. A um, little bit different, okay, which is great. You know, we all, we always need something different to kind of evolve, uh, you know, the, the, the models that we're used to. Um, but yeah, this thing is going great. Um, let's see here. Uh, give me one second. Let me. Let's see what if we're, if we're compounding, right? And of course, if you, when you compound, you're getting 2%, right? When you're claiming, right? Or collecting or withdrawing, you're getting 1%. The other 1% gets burned. But if we look at our deposit balance right now, and let's say we get 2% for compounding, we're getting 3172 per day, which is pretty wild, right? And just for giggles, right? If we times that by 30, it's $95,000 a month. Of course, you know, that's a hypothetical number. It's not going to be exactly that because if I claim I'm not going to get 2%, the price of the token is going to fluctuate, may go down, may go up. You know, we'll see, right? It may continue to go up. Who knows, right? But it may go down. You know, we'll, we'll see. But this shows you, you know, the power of DeFi and what, you know, a contract like this can do. So, um, yeah, things are going fantastic. Again, you know, base is coming out. The ability to airdrop our team members is coming coming out. The lending protocol, which is going to be, I think that's going to be a game changer right there. You know, people have to buy the token and get into lending they don't have liquid, you know, tokens, which most people don't, right? So they're going to have to buy tokens and then they don't have to sell their tokens to lock in profits. So again, I've said it before, what do you think that's going to do for the price? Just logically, you're like on paper, what is that going to do? When you have to buy, but you don't have to sell, what do you think that's going to do for the price, right? We're going to see the price really take off. Um, so yeah, I mean, and minting right now is, now it's cheaper to mint. So we're going to see the liquidity really take off. Um, yeah, pretty crazy. So, I mean, you know, set your strategy, set your goal. Like I have a goal in my mind of what I want to do with this thing. Um, and I kind of have my strategy, you know, uh, of what I want to do with this thing, put your goal down, right? Put your goal down and put your strategy in place and, you know, do it, do what you need to do. Um, but yeah, this thing is cranking out profits. Um, uh, again, it's cheaper to mint right now. We'll see if that holds strong and if that holds up. But right now, if you're going to get you some tokens, you know, previously we were, we were saying, hey, go, go, you know, use the swap. By the way, don't use pancake swap. You're going to get killed with taxes. Before we were saying use the native swap, right? Um, that way you don't get killed with taxes. But right now it's actually cheaper to mint. So use the mint, right? Mint. And then what you do is get your tokens and then. Stake them, right? You know, if you want to hold some liquid, it's up to you. But, you know, stake them, get your 2% a day, get your passive income. This could be a passive income beast, right? Especially as we head into the next bull run. You know, what if this thing goes to 50 cents? What if it goes to a dollar? Imagine it goes to a dollar. <laughs> what people's balances are going to look like. Oh, my God. It's going to be insane, right? Um it's, it's possible, right? It's possible. Like, imagine this thing goes to a dollar, right? And it's dollar for dollar. Like, one token is a dollar. And our balance is a, it's our balance is like a million dollars because we have a million, we have more than a million to uh, tokens, right? Well, let's just say for easy math, we have a million tokens staked. We have a million dollars staked and we're getting 2%. What, I mean, that's, what is that, 20,000 a day? Is my math right? I, I, man, I'm not good at math at all. Let me see. Million. If if we have a if you have a million token stake and this thing goes to a dollar, right? And you're getting two percent. Of course, when you claim it's one percent, right? But you know, let's 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 work this out. 
That's $20,000 a day, a day. Oh, that'll never happen. It's happened before. It's already happened. It's already happened. Yeah. If you watch my drip, my drip videos are still up, I think. I don't think I pulled any of them. Well, I think I pulled some of them down, but most of my drip videos are still up. If you can, you, you can watch my drip video. We were making eighty, ninety thousand dollars a day with drip. Yeah, insane. I'm not saying that the same thing's going to happen here. We, I don't know. Who knows? Uh, I'm not saying that. Hey, this is going to be. The, uh, I don't know. But it's looking good right now. I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll take where it is right now. I mean, we don't need to have another thing like that happen for us to do well. Like if it stays where it's at right now and just continues to do what it is and I'll take it. It's doing great right now. We don't I don't need it. I don't need to do, you know, what you know, what what uh what Drip did. You know, we're it's doing great right now. We're doing phenomenal with where where it is right now. Um you know, do I do, am I bullish on this? I think do I think the price of the token is going to go up? Yeah. I mean I just said when when lending comes up when lending launches you know, do I think the price is going to go up? Yeah, I mean, just logically on paper, it's going to go up, right? When people have to buy it and they don't have to sell it, it's going to go up. So I, do I think the price is going to go up? Yeah, but I said it before, I'll say it again. If the price doesn't go anywhere, but we have something that pays us 2% a day. What is that worth? Like, we can still make a lot of money with this thing, right? Anyway, just my two cents. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. In any case, if you want to check this out, I will leave a link down below. You need BNB right now to get into the contract. Make sure you have BNB to cover the gas fees. Um, some of you guys are like, well, I'm going to hold off until base launches. Why? Why would you want to hold off? The tokens are bridgeable, right? It's bridgeable now, I believe, right? The tokens are bridgeable. Get in now, right? And then when base launches, you know, bridge your tokens and you're fine. Like, you don't got to wait till then. Like, why would you wait, right? I, uh, people bug me out. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. And then later on, oh, I got in late. I got in late. <laughs> oh, man. People people are funny like that. Uh, anyway, Mint State Share, crushing it right now in the space, making DeFi great again. If you want to check it out, I will leave a link down below. As always, do your own research and due diligence, risk capital only. Yeah, make sure you follow me on Telegram, subscribe to the channel. They got an AMA this week on Thursday at 1 p.m. The same same time, same bat time, same bat channel. Um, again, the dev comes in. Um, you know, last week he came in. It was like a 30-minute uh, uh, AMA. Sometimes he comes in and, you know, there's a ton of alpha. Sometimes he doesn't. But even if he doesn't have a ton of alpha, the fact that he comes in and communicates on a weekly basis, you know, goes through an AMA, talks a little bit, that does amazing for confidence, guys. And that's great. You know, you want to have a dev that communicates you know, that, that's great for the for the number one for the community, but, you know, it's just great overall. So, yeah, plug into that. If you want to watch the replay, if you if you can't plug in live because you're at work or what have you, you know, the replays are available. Um, anyway, this is the main stake share. Let's go and have a great week. Catch you on the next one. Peace.